All right, the next thing we're going to work on is an angle block, a typical block that a guard or a tackle might make on a defender that is down the line of scrimmage, inside or outside, depending on where the player is going. And we're going to have the player go ahead and get ski. We'll have him to set four, set three, and take a six inch step with the foot that is closest to his block. So take that step, Fred. And now go ahead and get your head on the back side of him and drive. So take little steps and run your feet. Very good. So let's go ahead and cycle you out. Come on up, Coach Mike. Get ski. Set four. Set three. Six inch step go. Now run your feet, head behind. And we want to turn our hips there, Hayden. So let me go ahead and hop on in real quick. What we're going to do is get a good balance step, stance. So set it right down just like this. Our first step is that six inch drive. And then we just want to take real quick steps and just settle right down just like that. Okay, Paul, let's go. Ski, four, three, one, go. Come on back, Paul, come on back. You're gonna take that six inch stick step with it. What we do not want to do is we don't want to start with this foot because it'll close our hips. So get ski, set four, and three. You'll take your first six inch step with that foot. That's right. Run your, then run right around the side of them. So here we go, four, three, and set, go. Good job, and smaller steps. All right, here we go, ready? Ski, four, three, go. Good job, and run right around them. very good. Here we go, Hayden, Get ski, four, three, set, go. Good job, good job. Keep your wide base, guys. We do not want to have your feet get closed together. If you get your feet closed together, get your feet closed together and the defender pushes you, you will fall out of the way. But if you spread your feet out nice and wide and you sink your hips and you keep your head up and your chest and they push you, you'll have leverage on them. So let's keep that, uh, let's keep that foundation for blocking. So ski, and four, and three, set, go. Big step, that's a big, big step. You need a couple of little fast steps before you get going. Let's go, Freddie. Ski, and four, and three, set, go. Good job. All right, not bad. Let's go one more time through for you guys, okay? Here we go. Ski, and four, and three, set, go. Good job, baby. Good job. All right, let's do it all together here, Paul. Ski, and four, and three, set, go. Good job, Paul. Good job, baby. All right. Coach Mike, let's go ahead and go on the other side. Guys, come on this side. Let's go real quick. We'll just hit one or two sets off going the other way, okay? So this time, we're stepping with the foot that's closest to our block. It's a six-inch step. We're going to get our body turned, and we're going to run our feet real fast like chops and push them out of the play. So ski, and four, and three, set, go. Good job. All right, Freddie, come on back. Hayden, ski, and four, and three, set, go. Come on back, Hayden, do it again. Take your time, okay? Take me one good, show me your first step before you take off, okay? Ski, and four, and three, one step. Go. Make sure you turn those hips. Good job. We we'll do the same thing for you, Paul, okay? Take me one step before we take off. Ski, and four, and three, one step, go. All right? All right, full speed ahead, guys. You can give a nickel to anybody who can not coach my court. Ski, and four, and three, set, go. All right, let's go. Ski, four, three, set, go. Good job, Dave. Good steps. Ski, and four, and three, set, go. Good job, Paul. Keep your hips on. Okay, so it's just important to rep that, rep that, rep that. If you've got offensive linemen, very rarely do they got somebody right up on their head. The kids just go wherever they want to go out there half the time in youth football. So you rep that thing and you get some marks.